Because. <laughs> yeah, didn't ask for it, but I'm giving it to you anyways. And so is Jacko Boy. He's back. What's going on? I was never gone. I was never gone. Yes, master. Anyways, this is going to be the uh, Can You Feel My Heart Isolated Vocals, just to see uh, what we can analyze and whatnot out of this and and just hear what uh, Ollie's vocals sound like by themselves. I think the next reaction that I'm going to do, because I wanted to show him some Gojira, because that's a really, really good band. I like them. It's like 90s metal mixed with today's stuff. And I love it. It's really good. But anyways, we're going to get into this right now. Can you hear the silence? Can you see the dark? Can you fix the broken? I like how he, at the top of his vocals, he goes broken. Kind of he adds that flair. Listen again. Can you fix the broken? It's kind of like a... Uh, Oh, right there and i like that the bro no god please no no can you feel can you feel the heart? can you help the hopeless what? well i'm begging on my night can oh. you save my bastard soul will you wait for me Sorry, brothers. So sorry, lover. Forgive me, father. I love you, mother. Nice. I hear some layered vocals there. Let's listen to that one more time. Uh, forgive me, father. I love you, mother. Can you hear the silence? Can you see the dark? Can you fix a broken? Can you feel the It's weird when I'm when I'm listening to this, I can hear the music in my head. It's like I'm scared to get close and I hate being alone. I long for that feeling to not feel it. Ooh. You hear the whisper track in the background? Yeah. Wow. You this is stuff you don't hear normally when you're listening to the full song because everything is hidden, but like there's like whispering like this in the background and it sounds so good. Hate being alone. I long for that feeling to not feel at all. The higher I get, the lower I'll sing. I can't drown my demons. They know wow. how to swim. I'm scared to get close and I hate being alone. I long for that feeling to not feel at all. The higher I get, the lower I'll sing. I can't drown my demons. They know how to swim. I'm scared to get close, and I hate being alone. I long for that feeling to not feel it all. The higher I get, the lower I'll sink. I can't drown my demons. They know how to swim. There's one specific thing I want you guys to hear really quick. You can hear a scream, and also like there's a very, scream. There's a scream, but there's also a whisper. There's there's a scream, whisper, and harmony going on in the background. Yeah. So listen. Right here, that's where it is. It sounds like a, a choir in the background, but you know it's Ollie. I long for that feeling to not feel it all. The higher I get, the lower I'll sink. I can't drown my demons. They know how to swim. Wow, that, that was sick. Can you feel? Can you see the dark? Can you fix the broken? Can you feel? Can you feel my heart? That sounded like two different vocals going into two different tracks. And they separated them and made them sound stereo by panning one vocal to one side and another vocal to the other. So... It's left and right vocals, and that ending was just really nice. I like that. That was pretty good. What the heck? What did you drop? I didn't touch anything. 
What'd you do? I don't know. Why, why are you doing stuff other than this? I don't know. You should be focusing on this. My butt hurts. You know why you're focusing on this? For them. That was a hand in my face. Well, it was, it was pointing to the camera. Don't you bite me. <laughs> Ollie's, I don't usually do reviews anymore, but Ollie's vocals are, are pretty darn good. He's very professional, and I don't, I don't think I really heard any autotune, which in those type of vocals, they're really hard to do, and you can't really autotune them, otherwise it would sound wrong. You could maybe do a little bit of pitch correction with Melodyne or something like that, but it still wouldn't work nonetheless, because then you still have that flatness. It would just flatten out. Okay, so you have this really full vocal that, that Melodyne would just flatten out, and it would just compress the graininess of the vocal and that wouldn't be good. So there, there, there wasn't that much effect, that many effects on his voice, except for there was delay I heard, and I heard a slight bit of reverb and, and honestly, nothing else really, except for maybe panning and, and a little bit of a chorus effect, but that was about it. Like I really enjoyed that. That was good. The, it showed his vocal range and how good he is. Like it was what in the world are you doing over there? Why are you doing things other than this? I know, I know. I'm <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Is it gonna do the vocals? <laughs> <laughs> that is scary. <laughs> the crap out of me. <laughs> is it gonna do the vocals? <laughs> So we're going to leave Ollie in there. We're going to like not do a comparison, but I mean, we could compare the two vocals of Elton John and Ollie, which are two legends. I don't, I don't know if Ollie is on the same level of legend as Elton John. No, probably not. I, I don't know. Well, he says probably not. I still don't know. I'm not saying anything because y'all are fans. Y'all, y'all think it's probably not in my opinion, but let's, I don't, let's see what happens. I don't want to hurt anybody's feelers. Send help. Pack my bags last night, free flight. Oh. Zero hour, 9 a.m. Oh, you go sharp. And I'm gonna be high. That was as good. As a kite by then. It's so smooth. One thing, one thing I, I uh, noticed about Elton John in this so far is at the end he does a little squeak at the end of his song like it mm? <clears throat> he goes then mm? i don't know how to do it like he does then mm? like it kind of goes upward if you listen to the ending of it and it goes a little sharp as a kind by then you heard it yeah yeah it's smooth like his vocals are smooth but it has this tail end that goes yink it's like a u and I envision it as like a cat's tail going zoop. Mm. It's a weird. I like it though. I miss the earth so much. I miss my wife. It's lonely out in space. That was smooth. There we go. On such a time, less flight. This is a tough song too. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time. Touchdown brings me round again to find I'm not the man they think I am at home I'm Okay No, no I'm a rocket man Rocket man Burning out his fuse out here alone Oh, I'm so sorry But Elton John, man Ooh, My heart And I think it's gonna be a long, long time I think those are his vocals in the background too, going, yeah! Oh, listen again, that sounds like him up high. Rocket man, burning out his fuse out here alone. 
Mars ain't the kind of place to raise your kids. Did it? You did that cat's tail thing. Yeah. In fact, it's cold as hell, and there's no one there to raise them. Oof. If you did. He did a really long one there. You heard that? Yeah. Did. Did. I think, honestly, though, I think he's using the form of um, vocal technique that I do, which is compressing your vocals. So instead of, like, singing with, like, like an operatic huge voice, a lot of people do this thing where they could go from low to high with, with a technique called vocal compression. And so instead of going... Ah, they go ah, and you can hear the difference in the vote in the vocals like ah, that sounds more full but at the same time if you're doing the vocal technique of vocal compression then you're going ah, without that you can't go as high as you could possibly go which is like if you're starting low you're like oh you can't really hit that really high pitched sound if you don't use that technique so it's like oh 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 that's as high as i could go without it so if i'm using that i could go from yo yeah i'm sorry i'm 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 a singer so <laughs> it happens anyways um I think he's using a very slight version of vocal compression, and I think it's really cool. I like it. And if you notice, a lot of R&B artists use it, and a lot of metal artists who sing use it. <clears throat> Ollie, I think, does use it sometimes, not all the time. And all the science I don't understand is just my job five days a week. A rocket man. Yeah. He's definitely using vocals. A rocket here. man. Mm -hmm. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time till touchdown brings me round again to find I'm not the man they think I am at home. Oh, no, no, no. I'm a rocket man. Rocket man. Yeah, that was him. You know how I could tell? The background vocals, they do that at the end. Listen, you can hear it. Rocket man, burning out his fuse, I'll hear the line. That is him. Dang, he can hit really high notes yeah. there. <laughs> think it's gonna be a long long time and i think it's gonna be a long long time and i think it's gonna be a long long time and i think it's gonna be a long long time and i think it's gonna be a long long time and i think it's gonna be a long long time no wonder why this guy got famous and I think it's gonna be a long, long time. Like, it's really hard to do that falsetto. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time. And I think it's gonna be a long, long time. I think he puts that ending in on purpose, though. Because sometimes that's what vocal compression does to your voice. You're like, time? I don't really, it doesn't happen to me. But for some singers, it does happen. And I think it's to help really, I think it's more of a comfort thing, to be honest. And to be, to be totally honest, at some points, I don't even think he's doing it on purpose. But honestly, guys, isolated vocals from Elton John, zero out of damn is a damn. Yeah, Ollie's amazing. Elton John is amazing. There's but no what comparison about, between the two. What about David Draymond? 
You get David Draymond from Disturbed is on. Oh. He's on an even higher level. Yeah, we'll have to do that next time. Yeah. Yeah. What do you guys think? Isolated vocals from uh, David Draymond from Disturbed versus who? Well, we don't have to do verse. We could just react to him. Okay. And his isolated vocals. All right. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, you hit that subscribe button, you hit that bell, and you select all, and make sure you go subscribe to his channel if he ever makes one. And, uh, yeah, he's going to try to get into um, you, you editing. Could, you can subscribe to me now. I have a page. I don't I don't post anything. I got nothing posted, so well, I'll probably be commenting below. Just yeah, so you if you guys... Just, you could just subscribe to me, and eventually, maybe one day I'll post something. But Yeah, hit... Honestly, dude, you should. You should try it out. Nah. Oh, ignore my unorganized mess over there. <laughs> can they even see? Yes, they can. They can. Uh, anyways, guys, catch you all later. Peace out. <laughs>